So here's the thing. You know what Pac-Man is, right? <laughs> okay, so I already spent about three hours working on this map. This should be the exact same one as the one from Pac-Man. And now that we got this going, here's what I have in mind. All of these walls are exactly placed five blocks apart. And that is because this guy, supposedly Pac-Man, <laughs> trust me, this is Pac-Man. And um, yeah, we're not going to have ghosts. I, I feel like making the game a little bit different. How I want to do it instead is that this fella over here uh, with a beautiful smile, he's actually going to be the bad guy. You actually need to run from him. So here's how the game is going to work. Basically, one player is going to be walking around this map. They have to collect these little coins and these coins on the ground, the, the buttons will spawn this. Once all of those are collected, the player wins. It's it's as simple as that. However, there's, you know, obviously going to be one small change. This little guy, after a few seconds, is going to start hunting you. And to give you a little perspective on what that's going to look like. Oh my god, I can I see you around, coming. Funny. Stop I it! Turn around. Stop! Now, the player does have one advantage, and that's these. There's four of them on the map, and just like the original game, it's a power-up. Now, originally, what it's supposed to do is it's going to make you strong against, you know, the, the Pac-Man ghost. However, obviously, the player is going to be stronger against Pac-Man himself. Oh, this sounds great and all, Fundy, but uh, you need to upload on the 29th, and it's currently the 27th. How are you even gonna start when you don't even have the code yet? Nothing is moving, Fundy. You're just- Shut up! I'm working on it. All right, so the first thing we had to code was the movement of Pac-Man. Obviously, if someone wants to play the game, they need some way of moving Pac-Man in, you know, all four directions. And initially, I wanted to do that on the player's movement, but having the player move while Pac-Man moves, yeah, it got a little bit gross. So I ended up finding a different solution. Okay, so here's how I I'm planning to make it work. So up here, I made a little platform, and while this might look far away, when you put FOV on 30, it's perfectly aligned, right? So you can perfectly see pretty much everything on the board. And I have four items in my inventory. When I scroll over them, this happens. Left, up, uh... Wait, wait, huh? <laughs> wait, it's it should totally work. Why is it so many ups? Wait, what's going on? These are both up? I'm very confused. Okay, I fixed it now. So now when you press these buttons, as you can see, it's up, right, down and left. And what I did is I bound my keys to U, K, J, and H, which means I can use those keys just like W, A, S, D to move Pac-Man. Okay, that's all great, but you know, Pac-Man is not moving. So that that's the other thing we got to do. I got to figure out how to actually make this guy move, turn, and do everything corresponding to, you know, up, right, down, left. And uh, yeah, that's going to be difficult. Okay, so I think I got it working, or at least, you know, I got simple movement working. So here's how it works. When I right-click this block with a golden ingot, it's not going to tell you that I did it, but I just did. And now, if I hover over these, look at that! So now I can use WASD <laughs> to move the block around. Wait, 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 wait. Is this, uh, is this one of those sponsor segments? Honey is a free browser extension that saves you money when you buy something online. Basically, whenever you buy something like a game or food delivery or clothing, Honey searches the internet for promo codes that can freely be applied to your purchase to give whatever you buy a discount. This goes fully automatic and is completely free. All you have to do is just hit this little button and honestly, it already works. That's it. After this, whenever you know buy something, it pops up saying, Hey, you want some discount codes? And that's it! I've had it chilling on Google Chrome for like over the past year, and it genuinely is a fantastic feature. On average, it apparently finds discount codes that save around 18%. Meaning if you buy something like a game worth $60, it can find a discount code that saves you $10. Do you know how much that adds up to? But make sure to use my link because that also helps me out. So if you're interested, go check it out. It's in the description. Give it a look. And thank you, honey, for sponsoring today's video. Let's get back to it. So I can go around the tree for for one, two. There we go. Oh, that's already really cool. But obviously, Pac-Man is a little bit bigger than that. So we're going to make it work with a bigger block than just one. Woo! <laughs> I can move whatever block I want. Imagine you just randomly see a tree do this. You just mind your own business and suddenly this happens. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a cursed tree! Woo! You reckon I can walk on this? Hold on. If I just like... Oh, that's really hard. Hold on. <laughs> I totally can't. Look at that. Pause Pac-Man for a second here. Oh, wait. That's... I'm going a bit too quick. Oh, I got it down. Oh, my God. Wait, that's so much fun. <laughs> now that this block works, we had to link up Pac-Man to it. And, uh, oh, boy, this was difficult. <laughs> See, it would be a lot easier if Pac-Man was just one block, just a retextured block. But instead, I made him three times three times three. Long story short, this was not going to be easy. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most scary thing I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, but it seems to work, though. I mean, it's turning properly. The only difference is it needs to, um, you know, obviously clear... <laughs> 
Clear the path behind it. It definitely needs to do that. But that should be easy. Okay, so I believe it now works where he should spawn. There he is. Okay. And he's facing the right way. Everything works. And when I move him, look at that. Up, right, left, down. Oh, that's great. I can make him move. I can even make him mow the lawn. <laughs> Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, I don't like that at all. I'm the one who made this and I hate it. Oh, I don't like that at all. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm going to invite like family friendly YouTubers. I'm literally telling them it's just going to be Pac-Man. It is not going to just be Pac-Man. Oh, God. Why have I made this? Oh, my God. It works. <laughs> oh, that took so long. Okay. So what I did is I actually made it so that he cannot touch walls. So even though uh, in this scenario, I'm always trying to push it that way, it's not going to be able to go through this because, you know, I made some checks for that, which means now no matter what but he should stay inbound of the grid, which means, you know, it just works. Look at that. Okay, he's selected. I'm going to go all the way up here. Ooh, I'm excited. This is going to be the first test run. I'm going to stand up here, right here, and then... <laughs> Wait, he's not moving. No! Oh, come on. I really thought it was going to work. Look at... <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, I did some testing. Only a little bit. Okay, let me, let me, uh, yeah, yeah, scrap that. Okay, second try. There we go. And then Pac-Man start. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's working. Look at that. <laughs> yes. Oh, wait. Okay, there's a little issue there, but mostly works. Look at that. I mean, I got to time my, my movement pretty well, but it works. Let me go down there. I want to try it like when I'm near it. I thought I was in creative. Okay, I want to try this out. If I stand here... Oh my god! <laughs> Why does this work so well? It's perfect! It is, it is actually perfect. I am amazed with how well this is turning out. <laughs> okay, I made a very small change to the behavior. Now it's actually predictive movement. And um, there's a slight difference, but it's such a huge difference. As example, take a look. It basically wants to predict where it, where it wants to go. Basically what is happening is whenever it moves in this direction, if you've already pressed right, but it can't go right, it basically remembers it wants to go right and the next right it can it will take it it makes movement incredibly smooth and uh very quick <laughs> i don't think you can outrun that let me uh let me get him on a long path we have him right here i'm gonna walk and we're just gonna see yeah you can't outrun that that's actually impossible. That's perfect. <laughs> it works so incredibly well. And with this face, it is so incredibly scary. <laughs> so next up was item spawning. We need some way for the player to pick up items once the game starts. So these little buttons on the ground should spawn items once it starts. And then obviously we have the little corner power-ups as well, which supposedly weaken Pac-Man. Yo, that's so good. Wait, what? Okay, well, ignore that one. That one fell. But look at all of these. By the way, if you're wondering why I'm so confused, uh, this is the first time ever in my entire life code worked first time yes look at that oh yes look at that that's per <gasps> it works i mean granted yeah i know illusion breaks they're just golden nuggets retextures but still what okay wait that's an issue Huh. Uh, okay. I don't know what's going on, but uh, let, let's just let's just ignore that for now. So what it was meant to show you is, I think it's called weakened? When you do this and now you move him around. Yeah, there we go. So now he's in weakened mode, which is obviously the sad guy. <laughs> looks so sad. Whenever he's in this mode, he's going to move a lot slower and the player should be able to catch up with them. If he dies, he just respawns. So it's not going to be that easy. After items were done, I kind of just went on a coding montage for hours and honestly just finished the game. The points ended up working. The power-ups worked. You can die if you touch Pac-Man. If you get powered up, you can kill him. And it even makes sounds when Pac-Man moves, which you can hear through walls. The closer Pac-Man is to the player, the more sounds he makes. And honestly, it's turning out great. But now now that everything is done, comes the fun part. I now get to lie to my friends about a simple game of Pac-Man without them knowing it was gonna be a horror game. <laughs> hey man, hey. Hi Fondy. Hello, Philza. Why am I here? Why have you trapped me? So, uh, do you have any clue what this is? It, it, I, this looks a lot like Pac-Man. So you, you know Pac-Man, right? It came out in 1980, you, were, you yeah, were there. I was definitely not though, I was you 80, were... 88, <laughs> mother... <laughs> Cool. All right. So. Okay. You're just leaving me here. All right. Oh my God. You just disappeared too. <laughs> oh no. 
and you just disappear. Good luck down there. You know how there's like ghosts and Pac-Man himself, right? Uh-huh. In case you're wondering, you're neither. Okay. I hate this. <laughs> this is like the back rooms, dude. Where do I go? <laughs> okay. Cool. Why do I hear that noise? Ah! What is that? What was that? <laughs> that is terrifying. Oh my God, I hear him. Holy shit! <laughs> no, this could really use some sound effects. Yeah, I'll, I'll add him. Oh God, that thing is terrifying. <laughs> waka, 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 waka. <laughs> I feel like the AI on this thing's not that smart, right? Okay, it's pretty <laughs> smart. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, turn around. Okay, 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 turn around. Okay. Oh my Come god! Come back here, you you bastard. <laughs> yeah! You pac man! <laughs> oh my god! Oh! Will you survive that? I don't know how. Oh! <laughs> yes! Oh, that was, that was well played. I can't hear it. Which is a good thing, I think. Why? Wait, Fundy, why is it? Why is there no corridors anymore? Fundy? <laughs> Fundy? <laughs> Fundy? <laughs> oh, I'm controlling him, by the way. You bastard! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god, this is so much more fun with two people. Do you control this thing? No. Why do I feel like you control this no. thing? No. Bring him here. <laughs> Where did he go? No! Get out of here! Come here, <laughs> Come here Pac Man. I see you camping that. Yeah, I'm camping this one I green one. I see it. You think I don't see it? I don't know what you can see. I'm stuck in this mess. Ah! Dude, you're legitimately so f***ing scary. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. I think this is all. Over. I think this is the rest of it. Oh my god, I hear him. No, 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 no. <laughs> so scary, dude. I'm ready to get my revenge. Oh god. Oh, I'm coming. Oh my god! Stop. I'm already on you. Oh my okay. god, okay. You've got me once, I've gotten you three times. Oh, you want me to start tryharding? Alright. That wasn't what I said, Bundy. Ah! Dude, it's so scary! It's so scary! No! That is so scary! I've got one and a half hearts. One I'm and a half? Make it. Oh my god. I can't even sprint. I really hope he doesn't Don't come out of nowhere. Let, come on, man. Come on. I'm I so really close. hope he doesn't come out of nowhere. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> yeah! yes. Oh my god! Stop! No! Yes! Don't turn around. Oh my god, I can Don't see you around, coming! Funny. Stop Don't it! Turn around. Stop it! I'm just, I'm playing with my food. I have half a heart. I have oh. literally half a heart. No! Oh my God. So oh, scary. by the way, you know how I was helping you? Yeah. Look at Pac-Man. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> I don't know where a single coin is. Really? Did I, what? Yeah, it should have totally triggered the ending. Are you kidding me? Did I get scammed? Yeah, did I think I so. <laughs> I oh think you did. Oh my God. Funny. <laughs> <laughs>